Releasing in cinemas this week is the new film from director Neil Jordan, who's been off making the television series The Borgias. Well, we've been waiting for his next film, and here it is. It's Greta, a New York set thriller starring Isabelle Huppert as a widow who seemingly accidentally leaves her handbag on the subway. It's found by Frances Chloe Grace Moritz, a girl from Boston who's living with her friend Erica, Micah Monroe, in Tribeca while working as a waitress at a fine dining restaurant at night. She returns the purse to Greta, who charms her, plies her with coffee and plays piano for her. Frances helps Greta choose a dog, but then she discovers something that disturbs her. Where are the candles? Uh, in the cabinet. Did you find them? She wants to disassociate herself from Greta, but she finds it's not so easy. The woman becomes a stalker. It's classic thriller material with a number of stupid twists. I found myself wondering how much more illogical it could get. And then I realised that Jordan was actually having fun with the idiocies, stressing in an almost primitive fashion the tropes of the thriller genre. I even wondered if he tried to elicit a fairly non-convincing performance from Chloe Grace Moritz. Isabel Huppert is no stranger to dark roles, and in fact, you sense she relishes them. But with this, you feel she just threw caution to the wind and decided to go for the idiocy in her own very French way. There are moments when her character is actually fun. The film's a bit of a throwback to psycho thrillers of the past. It's a bit of a shame it didn't make much attempt to reinvent the genre. Three stars. Everyone needs a friend. But we're more than friends. We're connected. There's something you need to know about Greta. What? Are you insane? Just try to get rid of Greta. 